Good morning guys, welcome to today's video. I have to tell you guys, I had a crazy dream last night. Today's all about not going anywhere by myself. Cause I hear voices. Sophie heard. And I start talking to birds. Yeah. Sophie and hears voices out. when she's alone. And Gabby is what, what are you on to? Dad has not been eating the olive oil. So Sam bought this big huge bottle of olive oil just before Easter because he saw on TikTok, he's addicted to TikTok, he saw on TikTok yeah, that he should take it morning and night and that it will, it fixes a lot of problems in your body. Have you been taking it, Gabby? No, I only took it once. Yeah, same with me. It's gross. He says he I loves like, it. I don't like drinking Oh my god, there's a bug on the wall. I don't like wall. oil either. There's a bug on the wall. Uh oh. Hang on. Gabby to the rescue. Gabby's gonna get that bug. We have not cleaned our house yet this morning, you guys. You know what I dreamed? What'd you dream? I that I had to eat shrimp eat. for a show or something. Yeah. So I swallowed a hole. And did you die? I don't know. I woke up. Because oh. my dad was taking up my whole bed. Good job, Probably Gabby. Day. First bug you ever killed. It's oh, ah! It's on me. You got it. Okay, now. So we're headed down to the barn. I decided to wear Sam's sweater that is covered in hay because then I don't have to go upstairs and get my own sweater. And I put my hands in the pockets. And it's, both of them are full of hay. It's cold today. It's cold this morning. It's supposed to be 18 or 20 degrees today though. Super warm. Still not riding my horse though. She's just slightly off. If you guys didn't know, she got kicked. Probably by a pony. And it's, she's so, it's not too bad now. Wow, you made a mess, Penny. It's not too bad. She always has to like pull it to her. Uh, her she got a little tiny kick right here. Oh, there's not even a bump anymore. I don't think. But the hair is still standing up. I think that's where she got kicked, right there. To be honest, yeah, I feel a tiny, tiny little kick mark right there, like a little something right there. So, anyway, I'm just, I'm erring on the side of caution. If Fiona looked at her the other day and said that she looked good, or that she was just a tiny bit stiff. So, I, mean, I don't want to rush it. I missed it. We're I'm not riding her, though. In the past, when we had a Stella, I only rode, like, in lessons, or only rode if... Like, I very rarely rode, but I've spent this entire winter riding Penny all by myself with not even an instructor in sight. So, I don't know why I said that. Awkward moment. <laughs> don't know where I was going with that. Other than I'm proud of me and I'm proud of Penny. I love Gabby's way that she carries hay. That's a lot of hay. Poor Daisy's still in training mode. Okay. Here. Daisy's like a typical dog. She tried to bury it. So one thing I didn't tell you about my dream, and this is something that I've known for a long time, and but it's really hard to implement, is that oftentimes situations occur and we feel frustrated and angry with another person and it just happens. Like you all know how it happens. I bet you could think of one person that you're angry at right now. Like that's how often it happens. Your husband, your kid, your anybody. But if you actually change the way you think about the situation, you get rid of all that anger. So, for example, if I looked at Sam when he did something that drove me crazy, and I looked at him and I just laughed, and I just accepted into myself that this is Sam, and this is him doing something that drives me crazy, and, and I just appreciated the fact that he was mine, and that I had him to be frustrated with, and that we are putting our lives together and making this beautiful story for our families. And I just thought of that when he did something to drive me crazy and I just laughed and felt love and acceptance when he's driving me crazy. Then very soon after that, I would only feel love and acceptance and happiness with him and not very much of what he does would drive me crazy because I would have trained myself to always have a happy emotional feeling to him no matter what he's doing. I know that's hard to understand, but it's true. When you're in a situation, it's all about changing how you feel about the situation because we can't control every situation. We can't change every situation to 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 
suit ourselves. So you have to change the way you feel. And if something is important to you, like your husband or your child or your pet or your horse, then it's important to change your mindset and accept them and accept things and fall in love with the imperfections of your life. Okay, enough, enough soapy stuff for today. Let's get on with the video and have some fun. I'm trying to do my hair. What, sappy? Gabby's like, I do not like these sappy mints. Sappy mints. You said Sophie. Good girl. Oh, that was so good. I didn't catch it. Sophie told her to sit and wait, and she was looking at that ball and wanting to run and chase the ball, and she waited till Sophie told her to come. So are you jealous that my horse does something amazing? I don't know if it's breaking. It's not breaking. It's technically in All right, you guys, settle this fight. Is it breaking? I always, I don't. I'm trying to get on my horse. <laughs> <laughs> my horse just stands still so I can get on. Please. It's true, I do that. That's not very nice of me, is it? So when I go to pick up Penny's feet, she immediately, lifts her feet. I just walk toward her with a hoof pick and she starts picking up her feet. She knows which foot I want her to pick up. She like is such a good horse. Like she just understands. She just, so I tell them all the time. I'm like, my horse just picks up her own feet or else um, when I get on, she just stands still. Like she just stands, just stands and stands. And um, I always tell that to Sophie just as her horse is not standing. So I guess that's why she, she feels offended. Girl. <laughs> I'm just here visiting with Penny and all of a sudden Gracie just comes running as fast as she can. She's like, I know that you gave her treats. <laughs> She's the funniest pony. She's seriously the cutest pony. We just brushed you a couple of days ago and now you're full of mud again. I'm sorry I bragged, Sophie. You literally bragged so much. I know, I don't know why. I think it's because I'm proud that I actually have something that's amazing. It makes me feel good that I have a horse that actually does some good things. Like, almost like I accomplished something, but she, I did not teach her that, she came like that. Okay, I know, I know how to describe it now. I know how to explain it. You know when you look at your horse and no matter what your horse does, no matter what problems it has, no matter how much money it costs you, whenever you look at your horse, you look at it with love. You have these rose colored glasses on when you look at your horse. And that's why you can love your horse so much and so unconditionally, no matter what happens, because you just see your horse and that, you know that feeling that you get when you look at your horse? It's overpowering love. So look, so that's what I wanted to say. Try and look at the people around you the same way you look at your horse. Try it. I promise you, it will only make you happy. She walks away, she gets in trouble. Right. Sophie's working on staying when she drops the leash. So good, like, now that it's warm out, we can get outside and do more fun things. Gabby, throw the ball in front of her. Like Gabby's working on no, no, no. Throw the ball in front of her. Come on up. There you go. <laughs> there you go. Throw the ball in front of Daisy, Gabby. This dog really wants to go. Have to be strict. Gabby just threw the ball and all the dogs are running. Are they gonna give her the release? What's the release? Oh. Oh my gosh, Gabby. The a, a ball in the face? No, it was Molly in the face actually. It was Molly in the face? Wait. She knows. She's like, I'm so over this. This is the most boring life I've ever had. You will never win. I will take my time coming to you. So we're going into a stay at home order or a mostly stay at home order. I don't know the details yet. I just heard 
that our, our stores are going back to uh, curbside pickup. So I have to get a couple of things. So we're gonna go to the store right now and get them before the curbside pickup comes into place. I think it's at midnight. These are Sophie's brand new boots. This is what she does with them. She still has the original packaging in them and she carries them all over the place. She carries them home. Trees. Yeah, she needs boot trees. We have boot trees. She carries them to the barn. She carries them back again. Why do you carry your boots back and forth? Why don't you leave them at the barn? Because that's unacceptable. It takes up too much space in the locker. Mm. Our tech store had this big online anniversary sale the other day and I watched it and I bought some stuff. So I'm gonna go pay for that and then I'm gonna buy Gabby Sophie a boot bag because she really needs a boot bag. Sophie's looking over here. There's that boot bag. Okay, so there's this one. Is that the Lemieux one? Um, is it Lemieux? It doesn't have a thing through her helmet. What brand is that? So this is the Noble one and she likes it. It's got pockets everywhere but it doesn't have a spot for your helmet. And, so, like the and she doesn't like the color. Let's go downstairs and look. I need socks because Take a look around because this is the last time we're going to be in here for a month because everything is locking down. Oh, look at those fly masks. They're adorable. They have way cuter colors. You and ear bonnets? Ear bonnets, yeah. And Weather, Weather Beta yeah. has way cuter yeah. colors, but my kids don't like them. Or they have this one, which is, yeah, I like it better. It's super cute. $9. Yeah, I like it. It's not as big. All right, you want that? So, look how cute that is. Oh, it is adorable. So it's gray instead of white. Oh so my. I decided on these fly masks this year. It needs a nose piece. Why does it need a nose piece? I feel like the horses hate the nose piece. I feel like our you only- You that with the ears. Ears and the nose piece. I feel like our horses hate them. So you guys know we've not had good luck with fly masks in the past. They need ear pieces. They hate the ear pieces. No, they mom. Need the ear pieces. Because they of the need... flies going in their ears? Yes. Well, we're going to try these. They were on sale for 20 bucks. I have the other ones still. But I thought we'd try these and see. And even have a spot for Finn's boardwalk. Yeah, like I, these don't seem the most non-bothering. Like when you put the fly mask over the nose, the, it, all their oh. snot gets on it and they just blow and blow and blow and it just annoys them. So Finn got that color. Finn, put his back in. Finn cut that color because it's the only one in his size left. And Storm and Chino got this color. Let's see. Super cute. I love it. I wanted them all to match. Penny got this um, coral color, I think it's called. You can see her. So there's the four colors on the on the front there. Oh, I love that. So that's the color Finn got right here. And then uh, the boys got that and Penny got that. So this is the boot bag I got. I, I really like it. So it's smaller. It's cute. I like the colors better than the gray one. They had the one Kaylee has. None of them had like a thing on the front, like a bag on the front to put your helmet. Okay, so I got three pairs of socks because they were on sale. I got this purple pair. Sophie's a willing to revisit the tall socks again. I got this kind, this color. Blue pattern. And then my favorite ones which mom found giraffes so these are our other fly masks most of our fly masks i keep them in here but i think i should wash the girls oh it's pretty i don't like the pattern it's not my style i love it it's so my style it's not my style hey pen i should have brought a carrot for you i did not hey pickle oh it goes onto her neck yeah, stay here. Stay here. We're going to put this on you. You're going to like it because it's the nicest thing I could get for you. So in the past, our horses have struggled with ears. Finn takes them out. And the nose. Finn just rips his right off. And it being dark and not being able to see. But look, at that's loose. Horses, flies could get right up in there and that would be bad. All right, Penny. <laughs> What do you think? I went to all that trouble to buy that, especially for you. <laughs> She's like, get it off of me. What do you think, princess? She likes them. Mints. <laughs> all right, so we don't actually need fly masks. 
uh, for flies right now. She does not love it. Come on. She's mad. I feel like she's grouchy because she's got the mask on and nobody else does. It's time, you guys. Time to cut this girl's hair. We're gonna give it a nice brush again. And then we're gonna cut it. And I say we cut it just to her neckline. I say we at least cut it to like here. No way, there's no way. Like look at how nice her hair is. It's but I know now. it's gonna be, no, it's so gorgeous. It's ugly. Like even not brush, we haven't brushed it for two days. And even not it brush. It has knots in it. Yeah, she, has, she gets knots every day now if we don't brush it every day. Penny's like, don't come with me. Don't come at me with those scissors. Like look at Penny's hair. I've let it grow. I trimmed it when we first got her thinking it would like help it to thicken out. You know how people say if you roach it, cut it all, shave it all the way off, but it doesn't. Like it's not a nice thick mane, but I love it still. I love your mane and her mane is going to grow all the way down to here and I'm going to let it grow. No, you are not. Oh, I am. No. Oh, I am. One day we're not home, we're going to chop it off. No way. Same oh, look Gracie. at it. It's just falling out, Gracie girl. Are you cutting it on an angle? Angles don't look good. Oh my gosh. I like it though. I mean, it's still just as cute. Well, let's start with this until I make sure I feel comfortable. All right, so that's it. That's the final look. I'm glad I got the video yesterday of her with her gorgeous mane. Um, and in two weeks, you won't be able to even see the cut mom, marks. When you said final, you know what song came to my head? Final countdown. Final breakdown. <laughs> oh, and do this, Gabby. Um, after. So we have to think about that. So that's it. That's it, Gracie. Yeah. You're still cute. Just not as cute. <laughs> You're still cute. Yeah, you are. All right, Willow. I like Willow's long hair, too. I hate Willow's long hair. It looks so bad. On the other side. You already cut it? On the other Wait, side. Wait, we didn't agree to a length. You don't need to. Hi, welcome to the Day by Day family where we cut our horse's mane so they look awful at the beginning of the summer. Hey! <laughs> it's Corona, no one will see them. Yeah, it's Corona. We're back in Corona. I'm actually really happy with it. What do you guys think? If it was gonna happen, that's the best case scenario. You look cute, Gracie. Maybe shaving this pony down. I like her hair, her hair's cute. Maybe shaving this pony down will let the vet think she's thinner than she is. I want to fully shave Get a good face shot, Willow. We are going to shave our pony for the first time. I know it's super controversial and a lot of people don't believe in it. Um, but where she came from, they shave their ponies, their show ponies. It's going to make her more comfortable probably for the winter or for the summer. And so we're going to try it. winter, we wouldn't have No, her. yeah, we wouldn't be. But and while you have the razor down here, we need to do all the horses... Uh, Bridal paths. Okay, so <laughs> this is it. Uh-oh, she knows. You're okay, Willow. It's okay. Yeah, good girl. What a good girl. Oh, what a princess. What a princess. Yeah. Uh-oh. Mom, while you're riding, I'm going to work, Willow. Yeah, I'm hoping to ride today. Yeah, work. Now we can see the fat. Should you go down instead of up? No. It's oh, it's in a heart. Aw, there's a heart. And that's a crown. Mm -hmm. Good girl. Do you want to tell you to go up? Yeah. Don't take it like too close to the skin, I, I feel like. I'm not. It's a crown. I so... I want to put a heart in Penny's bum. I want to put like a crown in Willow's bum. Look at all that. We want to put a crown in your bum, Willow. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look, and it's another heart. I see That's a sure sign. When you accidentally make heart shapes. Once we're done, we'll go re over. Yeah, go just over. skimmer down. Like, just get it all gone, and then. Can I try? Oh, such a good pony. Such a good girl. It's definitely nap time. I can tell by the way they're just like, doo doo doo. Is that her color, or is that. Dirt. They turn a different color underneath. She's a smoky 
she's a smoky black. That's her color. We have a gray. Mom, we yeah. have a gray. Oh my gosh, we now have a gray pony. <laughs> oh, that's what we'll have to call this video. Meet our new gray. Our new gray pony. Penny's like, let me have some fun. Let me do it. Penny, I'm going to take you for a I walk. I really want to shave Penny, though. Me too. Oh, I do not want to shave Penny. She'll be so cute. I've seen pictures of her, Penny. She's a lot of fat, but it's hard to clip. Don't but listen, Willow. Moves. Don't listen, there's Willow. There's the, there's the. Oh yeah. The See the difference in the color. Super cute. Super cute. We should give her a bath to get rid of all. Yeah, we could give all of our horses a bath today. I also That'd want be this fun. with them. So if you want a new brush. That See, was that was an after old. After a one. while, and you brush it, and you make sure it's not hot. Can you pass me the clipper spray? It's getting hot because there's a lot of hair. Well, I'm gonna put the camera away, and we Danny are going to show it. you the final Danny willow. The final willow when this is all done. Okay, it's been like an hour later. I'm gonna show you guys what I've been doing. I'm not gonna show you Willow, you're gonna be shook. She's so gorgeous, like, can't even believe she's ours. Okay, but this is what I've been doing. Essentially, I've been cleaning up our tack room a little. It's not perfect, it's never gonna be perfect. We were 11. Let's see it, bring it down. No, it's dust. It's full of dust. So our saddles that we have at home, who knew you could collect this and many saddles? Like, this seems insane. Um, we had double horns. Oh, Storm and Gabby at 11. I remember when they were proud of that jump. Now well, look at them. Sophie and Stella. Okay, so I did not go through this. I do not even know where to begin with this, but I did do this shelf. It's got all of our boots and all of our helmets, some stirrups. So the saddle pack collection is a source of trouble. It's always gonna be like that. That's better, lets more light in. But basically we have that pile of saddle pads and that pile of saddle pads and then we have some saddle pads at the barn. So essentially all I did was clean this section. These are what we have stored. Those are not even completely full, but those are the stuff like when we move, hopefully knock on wood one day, um, that's what we'll put all of our barn stuff in. But, so I clean up that. And then over here I cleaned up our table. I technically would put all of these supplements inside one of these baskets. Like put, my idea is to put it in a basket and then pull the basket forward and put the supplements in, but Sam does supplements most of the time and yeah, I just don't think he could handle that. And at least it's a little bit cleaned off. Then I cleaned off underneath here a little bit. Actually I should pull them all out and clean it behind there. But that is it, like it took a long time to do that. I'm really excited for you guys to see our new pony. Like she feels like a new pony. Like I was not expecting something as gorgeous as what we just got. Like, okay, she's done. Sophie and I had to have a snack. I had to go up to the house and get us a snack because. In, okay? Look, look. Hey, no. No, I wanted her to. No, she, I wanted her to. She was terrified of that bag. And then all of a sudden I came out and she I had her. Up. She had her face in there and she was, oh, I love it. All right, here she comes. It's our new light colored pony. Oh my goodness. Honestly. I was never the one to write up a song for just anyone. I, I was always the one to find myself lost in all conversations. Oh, because I've always been told that things will unfold if you keep on waiting. But then you came along and proved me all wrong I was so mistaken Cause you glue all the pieces back together all right, So we're gonna give her a little quick bath right now Gracie still looks really cute You think we should shave Gracie? Just joking Yeah you, you take all my wrongs and make them better Yeah you, you're making me wanna try forever And I feel so free Oh my sweet baby I was never the one to give up the ghost No, I was so stuck I kept on playing my part Wanted to give up cause nothing was changing But with you it's so clear And now that you're here I see colors in every spectrum 
Cause I finally learned my lesson Cause you glue all the pieces back together Yeah you, you take all my wrongs and make them better Yeah you, you're making me wanna try forever And I feel so free Oh my sweet baby Don't you know